So watching back our last game, I did have Hawkinson wide open at the end of that game. I ran backwards like an idiot. But in my defense, I didn't know that, like, I, I should have known this, but if you throw the ball away when you run the ball 60 yards backwards, it just ends up being intentional grounding. For some reason, my brain did not comprehend that. But we won last week, and that's all that matters, okay? So now we're on a short week playing against none other than the New York Giants. We're 10 2 and 1. We control this division, we control this um, conference. And right now, everything is going Minnesota's way. And we're starting off on defense as well. All right, first down 10 here. Oh, wait, they have um, Daniels. Jaden Daniels, I think his name is. What's his first name? James Daniels. What's the guy's first name? Hold up. Jaden Daniels. Okay, so they do have Jaden Daniels. Uh, that's actually a rookie from this draft class in real life. So this is actually, I think he's like the third or fourth quarterback off the board. It depends. I mean, I know Drake May is up there. Caleb Williams is up there. Bo Nix is up there. All these guys are up there. But second down three here. It's a motion in the ocean right here. It's going to be a run play. Okay. Not the greatest, but you know, it is what it is. First down 10. So they do have Saquon Barkley. We've got to keep an eye out on him. The receiving core is never usually that great, but I don't know the mobility of their quarterback right now. I really didn't look too much into Jaden Daniels. Actually, let me see. I can actually see this right now. He has 89 speed. Okay. Hmm. Darius Slay is out for the game with a broken finger. Um, 89 speed. That's fast, and that means that he's going to probably run a couple times in this game, and we're going to have to be ready for that. Hopefully, he can't throw the ball too well. All right. Third down seven here. I'm not going to quarterback spy him until he does one run, and then I'll quarterback spy him. The fact I almost got there really ticks me off, man. The fact I almost got there, but I was too slow, really ticks me off. See, this is the moment where... I don't love having, like, I love Ford, but he's a big guy, and he's not fast. So if I go against a mobile quarterback that's fast, it becomes a little bit of a problem. Dude, Saquon Barkley is too damn good. <laughs> the only good thing about this offseason, upcoming real life, is that Saquon's probably leaving the Giants. And hopefully, I don't know where I want him to go, though. Actually, you know what? I kind of like him on the Giants, because Giants don't really impact us. So maybe, I guess, in a real life scenario... The Giants was in a bad place for Saquon Barkley. He goes somewhere with the Chiefs, it's over, man. It's absolutely over if he goes to the Chiefs. All right, third and inches. Quick pass. Uh, down and roll. All right, first down 10. Come on, boys. One play at a time here, defense. Freaking slowly dotting us up. They are playing so methodical and so, like, just perfect down the field here. They're not throwing big 60-yard passes. They're not trying to do too much. They're running the ball effect efficiently, and they're throwing it for like 10 yards at a time. It just works so perfectly for them. Okay, we stopped them. I don't know about this. Because they got Saquon Barkley in that backfield. I got to be careful. They got Saquon Barkley, and they also got a mobile quarterback. They haven't even had to run their mobile quarterback yet. And it doesn't matter because they dotted me to fluff up. Right. Defense was not able to take care of business. Let's go offensively. Okay, I was really hoping my left guard would pick up the block. <laughs> I was really hoping that left guard was going to pick up the block right there. Um, Man, playing a tough game against the Jets now in a short week. It's not for the faint of heart. I'll say that. I'll at least say that. We do got Ray Davis back at least, so at least we got our king back. Alright, they're down seven. They're a little bit of pressing on um, Jay Jettis here. Okay, well, that's not exactly what I wanted. I should have went with the slot there. We're going to punt the ball. I'm not going to play aggressive here because we're not starting off good on defense. And the last thing I need to do is give them short field position. There we go. Great tackle right there. Great. All right. Another drive. Another chance for greatness, right? First down 10 here. Come on. 
Dude, if we can't shut down Saquon, this is gonna be a long freaking game for us. All right, well now their guards hurt, so <laughs> we'll see how that turns out. Second and four here. Come on, boys. Get some pass. Uh, get off. I was like, get off of me, man. Oh, great. Leonard Williams is hurt now. Like, their guy gets hurt. I'm like, all right, well, now we have a better chance. And our pass rusher gets hurt. So that doesn't help. All right. All right, they're killing with these underneath passes. They are killing me right now with these underneath passes. Just a simple dink and dunk. I'm going to have to play more aggressive underneath. Because this is like right now their bread and butter. It's just the little simple dink down passes. Okay. Ooh. I thought he was going for the linebacker there across the middle. And I had a corner. I mean, it's the linebacker right. I, mean, I thought he was going for the tight end across the middle. And I had a linebacker right there to shut that down. I was about to get so excited. And then I saw the, how it worked out. Second and five here. Run play. Okay, third down and one. Let's go get them off the field. Give our offense another chance with the football. So all we got to do right here, boys, get them off the field. Okay. Incomplete. Let's go. They're going to go for this, though. They're going to go for this. They're going to fake this. This is 100% a fake. Not even a question. This is a fake. How did they not fake that? I guess they had played good defense, though. I feel like I would have faked that right there. But I am like Dan Campbell in this franchise, so... I guess that does kind of make sense. I don't know. I felt like that was going to be a fake. Dude, they are so good at getting the edge. Like, I'm trying to outrun them to the edge and make a play every single time. And they are so good at just sealing that edge and not allowing me to get to the outside. Like, damn, bro. They're pretty damn good at this. I can't run the ball. And when a team shuts down our run, <clears throat> our run, <clears throat> that's when things go bad for us. Um, <clears throat> all right. Um, shoe. Let's go with all typical four verticals here, man. I'm going to have to get some type of offense going. The offense so far this game has been piss poor if, at best. I have never had a punt blocked in my whole entire Madden career. And I didn't have it this time. Look how close that was to being blocked. That was so close to being blocked right there. Holy cut. They, look, their guy wasn't... He thought... Their guy thought it was a block. So he started running up. And then once he realized it wasn't blocked, he ran backwards and got it. Oh my god. I have never had a punt blocked, and I almost just saw one in my life. That's crazy. Thankfully, it wasn't, because that would have been the scariest thing ever. All right, let's go, boys. Second and 11 here. A little bit of press. Get to that line. Motion in the ocean right here. Come on, boys. Get some type of pressure on him. Maybe underneath. Oh, that Dottaroni, man. And that run after the catch. You gotta be kidding me. You gotta be freaking kidding me. You guys could not tackle him in any way right there. Okay, technically that was my fault, I think. I don't know. I, I clicked on, but my guy still could not tackle Darren Waller. And then I clicked one here, and he just a really bad angle for Blackman. Also, how tall is Darren Waller? Because he looks like crazy tall. He's six foot six. I didn't know he was that tall. All right, man. This first half so far has been um, not what we wanted out of this first half. I'll say it like that. One pass for 11 yards today. We just got our first completion. Man, playing on a short week sucks. I'll tell you, <laughs> you play a tough game and then you have a short week. All right, first out of 10 here. Trying to get my real run game popping, as always. My little stop and go technique. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Second down and seven here. Let's 
Good job, Ray Davis. All right, third down and four. Um, I guess I'm going screen pass here. Hopefully this works out. Hopefully they don't read it. They have home field advantage, so the screen right now is shaking. Oh, they did not read that one. They did not read that one, baby. That was a good play right there. Now, we do get ball to half, so keep that in mind, you know. They started with the ball. They started off with a pretty damn good drive. We get ball to halftime here. So, we have time to work and figure things out. But that's really what this comes down to, is working and figuring things out. I want to run the clock here. I don't want to give them the ball before halftime again. But, I also... Yeah. How is he not faster? How is he not faster than them? What I wonder is, how, how fast are their guys? Because they're able to keep up with everyone I run with. Like Ray Davis with, um, uh, what's the name? Caleb Williams. Like, how are they able to keep up with my guys? Their guys should not be this fast. Everyone we play against, they can't shut down with how fast we, they can't stop us with how fast our quarterback and running back is. For some reason, this team can do it. I don't get it. They read the screen, but oh, their guy actually did catch me. I was about to say, their guy couldn't catch me. Because he actually read it, but he read it incorrectly because he was too far off. He just still wasn't able to get me and he dove. Alright, second and nine here. Touchdown. <sighs> okay. Yeah, no, it's all good. It's all good. Was a touchdown. Was a touchdown. Alright. He caught that. Call a timeout there. I can't kick a field goal here. I gotta go for it, man. I gotta be careful, though. 20 seconds. Touchdown. There we go. There we go, baby. There we go. With one second to go before halftime. With one second to go before halftime. They ran the ball. Stinkwon Buckley had a 75-yard rushing touchdown. They got the ball back with 13 seconds to go before halftime. And the first thing they do is run the ball with Saquon Barkley for a 75-yard touchdown. <sighs> Dude, I... They beat me. I'm defeated at this point. We're now down by two touchdowns coming at halftime because that 75-yarder before halftime. Alright. Nah, it's all good. It's exactly, exactly what I wanted to happen. I was excited, you know? I thought, hey, we're going to halftime. All they had to do is just run the clock off, and we're going to halftime. Nope, they're going to run a 75-yard touchdown. Play action pass. I was going to, I was thinking about rat catching that, but I'm like, don't rat catch it, because somehow, someway, the guy's going to catch it and not get a first, oh, not, he's going to get out of bounds and not going to count it, so I just possession caught that for that reason. All right. Ray Davis. Hey, at least we're getting an offensive drive here. That's the one positive note in all this. We're actually getting an offensive drive going here. First down 10 here. All right, John Yu, please pick up 29. Well, he picked up 29, and Hockin' Sox couldn't block. Hockin' Sox, you got to block your guy, my guy. You are the money player there. You block your guy. That's a touchdown. All right, second and seven here. Running a little bit of crazy trickery. Easy. Easy touchdown. Easy touch. All right, so now down by seven because of number 26 on the field. Yeah, number 26. Love you, buddy. I might want you to leave the Giants for after this game. All right. Underneath. Dude, how is Saquon, I mean, no, let, let, me, let me rephrase that. How is Saquon beating us when we knew Saquon was a problem going into this game? <laughs> we knew the game plan was Saquon Barkley. I, bro, I can't. I'm trying to get off this center to get after the quarterback. This center is literally manhandling me. This center is grabbing me. I cannot move off the center, bro. Like, who is this center? 
Is that John Michael Smiths? Because apparently he's like John Michael MVP. Dude, we literally was three centimeters away from sacking him right there. Gets out of the pocket. Throws a completion. Down. How? Alright, man. First down and ten here. Apparently Jaden Daniels is that guy. Guys, you heard it here first. Jaden Daniels is that Alright. Second and six here, boys. Second and six. The Bengals are three and ten. That is actually low-key amazing. Third and five here. Just get your tackles, make your tackles, and we'll be fine. Man, if we lose today, we're going to be half a game above the Lions, but we're still going to be in a bad spot. we got to win this game. And there's the run we expected from Jaden Daniels. I just expected that run a little bit earlier in the game. All right, well, we held him to a field goal. Positives, boys. Positives. One play at a time. That's all we can do at this point. <sighs> One play at a time. One play at a time. Alright. Let's go back to the run game. Let's try to pop off this run game a little bit. Get this run game popping. I know time is ticking, but at the same time, you can only just, you know, you can't go, you can't get it all back in one play. So, good couple runs. You know, play good defense. Right now, also, I want to rest my defense a little bit. We don't need down by 10, right? We have a chance. So, get my defense rested. Get them off the field is going to be huge here. Just so that they can actually, like, you know, calm down. Because our next drive, we score a touchdown this drive. Our next drive has to be a stop. There's no if and buts about that. We have to get a stop next drive. Alright, um, go back to the tight end here. Yeah, oh, I love this play, actually. Loki, I love this play. Give me time. Give me time. You gave me time, and I delivered. All right. How do I want to go about this? I want to score fast, kind of. But not too fast. As I said, I want to get my defense rested. But I want to get my, um... What's it called? I want to, um... Sorry, I'm about to sneeze. <laughs> I was like trying to speak and try to sneeze at the same time. I was going to say that I want to play this smart though because I want to get my defense leeway room in case they're not able to get a stop right away. You know? So, stuff like this is um, Tateroni. All right. First down and 10 here, baby. First down and 10. Come on. Drop back a little bit. Saquon, we knew you were going to be a problem when you walked in, buddy. All right, see, this is why I give myself some lenient room in case something happens. If we could actually not allow Saquon to do this, that'd be great. But I figured Saquon might do something like this. So that's why I, gave, I went and score fast. Okay, I could have ran it down to two-minute warning and tried to play just three and out defense. But that's not how our defense has been playing today. They've been playing bend and break. That touchdown before halftime, man. That touchdown before halftime was bull crap. That was bull crap because now that's why we're in this situation right now. Okay. Let's go. I thought they were going to run the ball. That's why I blitzed them. But I also figured because Nickel cannot stop the run. Nickel is not good against the run. So I was like, do I come out in Nickel defense? And I'm like, they're watching him throw the ball deep. Watch him just go deep with the ball. And that's exactly what they did. Picked off. Let's go. Let's go, baby. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. Alright, let me calm down because I still got to get a touchdown here. We still got to play some, we got to do some good things on offense. Oh, Ray Davis. This is why we got Ray Davis. That's why I love Ray Davis. Alright, we got to play this smart right here. Rookie mistakes were made right there. Whoa, I got to hide the ball because the guy had to run across the whole entire line there. Good job, Ray. Freaking Ray Davis, man. Oh my God. <laughs> So good. He is so freaking good, man. All right, I'm taking this out of the two-minute warning, boys. Hang on. All right. Ray, you just got to get in the end zone, baby. You just got to get in the end zone here. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Hold up. Hold up. Oh, I am finding my inside zone play I like because it usually does really good in this situation. So, 
I'll run the ball right. Nope. Inside. Where's inside zone? Inside zone. Um. Right here. Okay. This is the play I love to call in this situation because it just gets good blocking. <sighs> okay. Okay. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. We're not gonna run the ball again. Do I call a screen? I don't know if I call. I don't think I. I don't call a screen. I don't call a screen. <sighs> if we had to kick a field goal here, I'd be really ticked. Mike Hilton. Okay. We'll kick a field goal. I should have... I'm, I'm stupid. I'm so stupid. I thought they were just letting the clock run, but they were... They, oh, crap. No. Uh, okay. Let me think. Let me breathe. Let me breathe. I lost the game earlier this year because of this. I went for it. <laughs> let's go baby let's go oh i'm even on the okay because it's good it's because it's a field goal game all right if i miss that holy crap you know what they say the dan campbell way you win by the sword you die by the sword that's exactly how dan campbell does it man i had to be the dan campbell of this you live by the sword you die by the sword baby all right, check down past cost middle. I'll give you that, but I'll give that all day long. I can't believe I went for that. And I, I didn't have the option right away. I had to wait for it. I just had to hope and pray that Caleb Williams could make the throw. Oh, man, they're, they're dropping them. They're dropping these passes now. They're just like, they're, they're nervous now. They're scared because they got one timeout in 18 seconds, which they have technically plenty of time to get it done. But pass play here. Picked off. Let's go, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Marcus Peters, baby. Marcus freaking Peters. No, we're, we're nailing it down. I would be cocky, but I just, I wanted this win too much, man. We wanted this win way too much to get this to happen the way it did. All right. We won last week, won this week. And I think this week is actually going to give us a playoffs. I think we're going to be at least in the playoffs. If not, we're not going to be divisional because we're half a game above the Lions. But we played the Lions twice, but obviously. But <sighs> man, that was that was a tough game. That was one tough uh, butt game. Tough butt game. All right. Well, you know what? You win them, you win them. Two interceptions. Peace out, guys.